It has been said that being a human is the top of the reincarnation pyramid, that our consciousness lives many lifetimes, working its way up through good deeds in less glamorous flesh. A gracious honeybee becomes a humble badger, becomes a pious sea lion, until finally opposable thumbs and pen station. <laughs> But perhaps we have been karmically misinformed. Human life all bad posture and mistimed death, jagged, swift, or painfully slow. Instead, the pinnacle of lifetimes well lived is awarded existence as a mayfly, alive for only a single day brief and blissful under a wet log, a bright patch of moss, one sustained 24-hour high with no responsibility but to procreate. I dreamt I got there once amidst a crowd of eager lovers our tiny translucent wings flapping in place like an ovation. The bugs talk quickly to each other. No time to lose. What is your name? Are you here with someone? What are you into? New friends buzz around looking for a private pocket of air. When suddenly, I remember it all. The soggy groceries, the barking dog, the months we locked ourselves inside together, like insects under a glass. I fly away from the swarm, cut off another mayfly in flight, steal a bit of algae from the feeding mouth of another, insult a pair of fireflies, minding their own business. Let him be, one says to another. It'll catch up to him. You'll probably have to come back as a human. I turn my tiny abdomen toward the sky, watch the sun's single arc, whisper your name, and wait. Westerlies.